Welcome to Fort Fisher State Recreation Area. Fort Fisher is one of many North Carolina state parks in this great state. One of our most popular activities out at Fort Fisher is driving on our approximately four mile four wheel drive beach. If you would like to come out to drive on the beach, there are some things you'll need to know. A permit is required to enter the four wheel drive area at the park. You can purchase the permit upstairs in our park office at 1000 Loggerhead Road from 8 to 5 every day except for Christmas Day. This is currently the only place to purchase a permit and it must be done in person. No online sales or phone payments. We currently offer day permits or our annual permit. If you come Monday through Friday, it is $20 a day. And if you come on a Saturday or Sunday, it's $30 a day. Our annual permit is currently $150 and expires December 31st no matter when you buy it. Cash, check, and credit are all accepted forms of payment, just no American Express. In order to drive on our beach, you have to have a valid driver's license and a registered and insured four-wheel drive vehicle. No ATVs or UTVs are allowed. When you buy the permit in the park office, you will be given the access code to get into the gate. Some items you might want to have with you that are recommended but not required are a tire gauge, a shovel, a tow or burr chain, self-recovery boards, and an air compressor for refilling your tires. Lowering your tire pressure is essential for driving on the beach successfully. We recommend 15 to 20 PSI. Lowering your tire pressure allows for better traction of your vehicle and keeps your transmission at a better temperature. We do not have an air station at our park for when you come back off the beach, but there are some located within a couple miles of the park at gas stations and car washes on the island. The hours for the four-wheel drive beach fluctuate throughout the year, but they will always be given to you when you buy the permit in our office and will be posted by the four-wheel drive entrance of the park. The only day of the year the park is closed is Christmas Day. This means that the four-wheel drive beach closes at 5.30 p.m. on December 24th and reopens at 8 a.m. on December 26th. During the off-season, which is September 15th to March 31st, the beach is open for driving 24 hours a day. You are able to fish all night, but not set up a campsite. This means you may have the footprint of your vehicle, but not a tent on sand. Propane and charcoal grills are allowed, just not open fires. If you do use charcoal, Please dispose of it properly in the concrete bins beside the visitor center. Do not leave it on the beach as it creates a hazard. Fort Fisher State Recreation Area is a state park, and as such, you must follow all the rules and regulations that go along with that, including no alcohol, keeping your dog on a leash at all times, and staying off the dunes. Once you go out the access road, continue to your right. You will see signs posted to your left that say, Stop, no vehicles beyond this point. Continue to the right and you can drive approximately four miles until you get to more signs that say stop, no vehicles beyond this point, as well as signs for Bald Head Natural Area. As you drive down the beach, please be aware of natural hazards. These could be drop-offs from erosion or areas that are impassable at high tide. Also look out for roped off areas, which could be turtle nests or bird nests. Some might have black landscape edging around them, or they might just be stakes. Please avoid these areas as they are federally protected. There are a couple of areas along the four wheel drive beach that you can use to access the marsh side. They are called crossovers. These areas can be used for kayak access, fishing, and other activities. Please stay only in the well-traveled areas, do not create a new track, and do not drive on vegetation. While driving on our beach, you also must follow all the same laws that you would a normal road, including, but not limited to, following the posted speed limit of 15 miles an hour, not allowing minors to drive or ride in your lap, and not driving recklessly, which means no donuts. You must be aware of your surroundings at all times, not only for bird and turtle nests, but for people and pets. We are extremely busy in the summer months. While we do not have a rule against driving low like some beaches, we ask that you be courteous by driving high in the soft sand to avoid others. While on the beach, if you notice a park violation or someone in distress, please contact the park office at 910-458-5798 or flag down one of our awesome rangers. 
For more information about our park and others, please visit www.ncparks.gov. This truly is a great place to explore. Please be safe and considerate to others while enjoying this unique state park. Hope to see you out there!